After three weeks of quiet, the eruption of Kilauea volcano resumed at the summit caldera on Thursday evening. Earlier in the day, the U.S. Geological Survey's Hawaiian Volcano Observatory raised the alert level for the volcano from advisory to watch after an increase in earthquakes and ground deformation was recorded at the summit. Then, after 4.30 p.m., the eruption began. The alert level was raised to warning. This video was recorded by the National Park Service, showing a tidal wave of lava moving across the reactivated lava lake. Scientists say there were several lava found bursts up to 50 meters or 164 feet high during the initial part of the eruption. The new activity is visible from various points inside Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. As of the evening, lava flows had inundated much of the crater floor, which is nearly 300 acres or 120 hectares. The red glow has also returned to the sky over the summit area. Officials say all activity is confined to the Kilauea summit region within the national park, and there are no indications of activity migrating out of the summit region. Also, the eruption has not had an impact on neighboring Mauna Loa volcano, which at this time remains quiet.